Ozzy gets trapped. Thanks for the lift, Brawny. The Brawny Island Express is at your service anytime. Call me if you need me. Rusty, Ruby, thanks for coming. I've got something amazing to show you. And for once, it's not rocks. Follow me! You're not gonna believe the plant I found. It's amazing! Whoa! I've never seen anything like it. Me neither. I found it when I was digging in a dark cave, which is weird because most plants love the sun. I wanna run some tests on it before I bring it back to the cave. We'll help, Ozzy. Yeah, maybe we can figure out what kind of plant it is. Let's see, we'll need one of these, two of those, that thingy there, this thing up here, and definitely some of this. Plants like granola bars? No, Ozzy's do. I'm starving. <laughs> Ozzy, I got your message. Is everything okay? Wait a minute. He found some new rocks, didn't he? It's better than rocks. He found the cutest little plant. <gasps> That's little? It used to be. I've never seen a plant grow so fast. Awesome! <laughs> it ate my granola bar. Woohoo! Snappy is a rare kind of plant that grows fast and likes granola bars. I named the plant Snappy. I wonder what else Snappy likes to eat. <laughs> Snappy can use her vines to move. Ah! And she likes granola bars and bananas and ah! And she likes me too! Ah! <laughs> Ozzy, come back! Ozzy! We'll save him. Okay, uh, I'll try to figure out what kind of plant it is. That might help us stop it. Good luck! A plant ran off with my brother. This island just keeps getting weirder. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, Ruby! <laughs> <sighs> Snappy's too fast. We'll never catch her. We could if we were flying. Dak, we need you. Dino flight! <laughs> Woohoo! Dak is back! You need to fly? You called the right guy. We need you to help us save Ozzy. A plant ran off with him. Whoa! That's weird and cool and bad all at once. Time to wing it! Woohoo! There they are. <laughs> Hurry, Jack. We have to cut off that plant before it disappears into the jungle. Hold on! It's about to get a little extreme! Steel. This is so cool. Not for me. We're gonna totally crash into those trees. Time for some mega turbo power. Let's go, turbo time. <laughs> Sorry, Dak. I think Snappy just wanted to play. Snappy's headed for Mystic Mountain. Why would she want to go there? I don't know, but she has to go through a narrow valley to get there. We can block it and stop her. But Dad can't fly in all those trees. Wait a minute. Spike, we need you. Rhino, fight! You got the vessel, so Spike's ready to hustle. <laughs> we need you to help us save Ozzy. A giant plant ran into the jungle with him. That's a new one. Let's get to work! Bye, Dad. Thanks for the help. Good luck! Okay, Spike. We need you to block the path with these boulders. <laughs> 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 
Cerebrat has triple strength! Snappy's almost here! Hurry! Oh. oh, run! Great job, Spike! It's working! I was nothing! Just doing my job! Ozzy, are you okay? I'm awesome! I'm learning all kinds of things about Snappy, except how to get her to put me down. Don't worry, we'll have you free in no time. Um, Ruby? Oh no! Snappy's huge! We've got to pull Ozzy away from that plant. What's making Snappy grow before she gets even bigger? Wait a minute. She grew when the sun came out. Maybe the sun's making her grow. Then we need to block the sun. Maybe she'll shrink again without any sunlight. But how can we block the sun? I know the perfect way. We'll get help from Dak. Did someone say Dak? Want to help us block out the sun? That sounds totally extreme. So I'm in! Let's combine it and dino design it. We'll start with Dak. Then we'll give him huge extendable wings to block the sunlight. And we'll add powerful jets to help Dak carry those huge wings. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Ronnie, we need you. Pronto on the pronto. I discovered a new 
plant and got to ride a pterodactyl! Ozzy, if you ever get yourself captured by a giant snapping walking plant again, I'm taking away all your rocks. I missed you too, bro. Looks like there's only one thing left to do. Welcome home, Snappy. And just in case you ever want a snack, we brought you plenty of granola bars. That should last a while. <laughs> or not. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to need a lot more granola. <laughs> Rusty's Island Mystery. Oh, yeah! Getting the job done with triple tricera strength! Great job, Spike. Ozzy and Oliver's camp is almost ready for the big windstorm. Okay, everything is all sealed up and stormproof. Woohoo! Now my rocks will be all right. They would have been all right anyway, Ozzy. They're rocks. I'll see you after the storm, my little rocky walkies. Need a little help with that? Sure. We'll seal that cave next. We just need more supplies. No problem. We've got lots of ropes and tarps right here. <gasps> Oh, no! They're gone! <gasps> the thief is back! Hide all the rocks! Wait, what's this about a thief? I'm so happy you asked, Spike. It started a few days ago. Things have gone missing all around camp. That sounds like a real mystery. Maybe Rusty and I can help you figure out what's going on. Awesome! Because if our supplies keep disappearing, we can't finish stormproofing camp. And the storm is getting closer! Good thing I have some backup supplies. Come on, Ozzy. Let's go get the rest of our stuff. Let's keep an eye out for this mysterious thief. What was that? Rusty! Help! What is it? Our backup supplies are gone, too. The thief stole our hammocks and pillows and blankets. And even the blankets with the little polka dots. At least it didn't steal Lil Fluffy. It's my favorite pillow. <laughs> Why, yes, you are, Lil Fluffy Wuffy. <laughs> hmm, the thief likes pillows, huh? Oliver, could we borrow Lil Fluffy? I have an idea. I'm not so sure, but Lil Fluffy says it's okay. I don't think I like this idea. It's okay, Oliver. Low Fluffy will be the bait, but when the thief tries to steal it, we'll catch him in the cage. Plus, my tablet will take a picture of anything that gets near your pillow. We're gonna catch this thief. Oh, yeah! I've never caught a thief before. It's very exciting. The trap's all set. Now let's hide so the thief doesn't see us. Oh, sneak attack! This thief is in for a big surprise! <laughs> Everybody hide! Ha-ha! We got the thief! <gasps> Oliver? <laughs> Hi. You're the thief? Good twist. I did not see that coming. I'm not the thief. I was worried about Lil Fluffy, so I ran in before the thief could get it. Wait a minute. Where is Lil Fluffy? Why, he's right here in my hands, of course. <gasps> oh, no! Little Fluffy, where are you? Wait, my tablet! Maybe it got a picture of the thief. There's Oliver right before he got caught. And look, there's part of the thief! Caught red-handed! Or red... Uh, whatever that thing is. I think I know what it is and where to find it. Spike, we need to get to Mystic Mountain. And we better hurry. We need to get our supplies back before the windstorm gets here. Say no more. Hop on the Triceravide Express. You two should probably stay here in case the thief comes back. Good idea. Is little Fluffy going to be okay? 
Don't worry, Oliver. I promise we'll find Lil Fluffy. Triceraton Express away! Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Lil Fluffy! It'll be okay, bro. Last stop, Mystic Mountain. Something just moved on that ledge. Aha! Just as I thought. Our mystery thief is none other than... a pterodactyl. And it has little Fluffy and the rest of our stuff. No! The storm's coming in. It's too windy. We can't climb the cliff. We've got to get up there, and fast. We need to get our supplies back from the pterodactyl before the windstorm hits. With my triple Tricera strength, I will carry them down in no time. If I could climb, which I can't. But otherwise, I totally would. Wait, that's it. We just have to turn you into a cliffside climber. Sounds good to me. Let's combine it and dino design it. First, we'll give Spike some tough treads to help him climb those cliffs. Then we'll add a giant crane to help him carry all the supplies. And a construction crane bucket for us to ride in. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Ronnie, we need you. Sneak attack. I mean, get ready for a sneak attack! The wind's turn's kicking up! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, Spike, you can do it! Getting the charm done! Tricky pterodactyl red-handed. Almost there. Ready? Sneak attack! Huh? It's a mama and her egg. She looks so cold. She must have taken the supplies to try and keep the wind off her egg. Did you find Lil Fluffy? Is he okay? Is he still Lil and Fluffy? We found Lil Fluffy. And everything else, too. Yeah! What about the thief? Is he scary with a pointy mustache and a top hat and a laugh like... Oh, 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 oh. Nope. It's a mama pterodactyl. She needed the supplies to keep her egg warm. Whoa, I was not expecting that. Good twist. Hmm. It sounds like she needs those supplies more than us. She can keep them. Even Lil Fluffy? Even Lil Fluffy. The windstorm is going to break this pile apart any minute. Hmm. A 
just needs to be a better shape. And I know the perfect one. Great idea, Ruby. Spike, let's build this mama and her baby a mega warm nest. This nest is gonna be the best! Don't worry, Mama. Your new home will be awesome. I promise. All done. Presenting your brand new stormproof nest. This nest will keep you snug and warm through the storm. And you don't have to take things without asking anymore. We're always happy to help. And there are just enough materials left over to finish stormproofing the camp. Sleep tight, little Eggy. One day you'll be big and strong like me. Triple Triceratops strike! Rawr! Oh, sorry, little Eggy. The storm's almost here. Now let's get back to camp. Just fine. Yes, but now we have another mystery on our hands. The mystery of the missing coconut. Ozzy! Oh, hey everyone. Something wrong? Mystery solved. <laughs> <laughs> what I do again? Rusty's Elephant Express. Attention passengers! The train from Stockton Hills to Gizmo Grasslands is now departing. All aboard! <gasps> uh, Mr. Higgins? We're right here. Oh, so you are. All right, passengers, let's see those tickets. Rusty, check. Ruby, check. Ranger Anna, check. Baby Elephant, check. Baby elephant. She says, here's my ticket. Oh, <laughs> in that case, welcome aboard, little lady. <laughs> Thanks again for helping me get Baby back to her family. She's been such a good girl while I've been taking care of her. No problem, Ranger Anna. I just hope Baby's got her trunk packed for the trip. <laughs> <laughs> He's been waiting all day to say that. Now let's load you into your special train car. <laughs> Okay, baby. We'll be right here behind you the whole time. Oh, I'm a little nervous about riding in a different car than baby. Don't worry, Ranger Anna. Check it out. It's okay, girl. I've installed the camera so we can watch baby the entire ride. And to keep her happy, I've installed some funky dance music. Dance party! <laughs> <laughs> you two are the best. Thanks. Now let's get Baby back to her family. Likes that song. So, so do we. we. All right, it's Anna time. Bust it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Great Caesar salad. Whoa, what was that? Uh, kids, are we slowing down or are they speeding up? <gasps> Our train car came loose. Oh, no. Baby! It's okay. I'll radio Mr. Higgins. Mr. Higgins, we need you to stop the train. Um, about that, I can't stop the train. Whatever we ran over must have jammed our brakes. Help! 
Okay, never mind. It looks like we have to stop the train, too. Yes, sirree, or it'll drive right past Baby's family. First things first, we have to reconnect our train car to the train engine. Hurry, Rusty! They're getting farther away every second! Time to go fishing for elephants. Now I'll just reel us back together. This could take a while. But we don't have a while. Look! We're headed for a track switch! We're gonna get separated again! Now we're going the wrong way! Things could be worse. Like if we were headed toward a cliff? Like that. We need a way to stop so we can help get Baby Elephant back home. That's it! Elephant Bot is strong enough to stop us. Great thinking, Ruby. Elephant Bot, we need you. close one. Yeah, even for us. Great job, Elephant Bot. Thanks for pushing us back to the right train track. <laughs> oh, good. Baby's still just dancing away. Impressive. Where'd she go? <gasps> we lost the video feed. They must be too far away. Mr. Higgins, can you hear me? Rusty? Hello? Please hurry. Almost to Gizmo. When brakes still don't work. If you can't. Mr. Higgins? Mr. Higgins, can you hear me? No, we can't hear him anymore. He's too far away. If he can't stop the train, it'll pass Baby's family right by. <gasps> we need another way to stop that train. Fast. Baby Elephant is so far ahead, and the train has no brakes. We need to catch up to them and stop it. But without an engine of our own, we have no way to reach it. Baby, if you can hear this, just keep on dancing. Rusty and Ruby will think of something. I hope. Where could we get something super fast? <laughs> super strong. And super nearby. <laughs> We've already got one. Elephant bot. Want to help save the baby elephant, big guy? <laughs> awesome. Let's combine it and design it. Elephant bot. Then we'll add train wheels and a front grill. And finally, a super powered engine to catch up to that train in no time. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile. Introducing the Elephant Bot Experience! 
Express 1000. Chugga chugga, so cool. All aboard. I've always wanted to say that. <laughs> Inventions are so great. But with this, <laughs> I'll take control of their inventions and show everyone how unamazing they are. Time for Rusty and Ruby to get Fritzified. <sighs> Our bots are the best. We'll see about that. Higgins, 
I'm having an ant problem, but I'll catch it. Robotastic. <laughs> Good luck, Rusty. Gotcha. Great job, Rusty. Now we can figure out what made your robot go out of control. What's better than one Fritz bot? Two Fritz bots! <laughs> Control bots means twice the trouble. We have to stop them. <laughs> Watch this, Frankfurt. Surf's up. Program them to do that. <laughs> hmm. <gasps> are those magnets? The bots are metal, so we can use heavy super magnets to stop them from jumping around. Yeah, then the magnets will slow the bots down and we can see what's wrong with them. We just need a machine that can fling the magnets up there. I know the perfect machine for flinging. <laughs> Our special magnets are ready. Okay, Flingbot. Fling! Control Rusty Bots is combining them into one giant out of control Rusty Bot. Time to get Fritzify! Yeah! Rusty, Ruby, your bots are out of control! Ruby, look! I think I know. Everyone thinks Rusty and Ruby made a giant broken robot. But I'm controlling it with my chips. And best of all, Rusty and Ruby will never know what happened. They're right behind me, aren't they? You can't combine bots that way, Frankie. Your chips will fritz out. No, they won't. <laughs> Maybe this wasn't the best idea. Ah! I think my Fritz chip spritzed out. Help! Look, those are the chips. 
The bots should go back to normal if we can pull the chips off them. But we'll need something even stronger than a mech suit. Like a giant mech suit. Let's combine it and design it. We'll start by combining our mech suits. Then we'll make a shield to block Frankenbot's magnets and webs. And we'll give it a long grabber arm to pull the chips off. Put it all together, and we've got our plan. Time to go mobile. Yes. Happy to help. We don't want our bots ruining a beach party. And speaking of beach parties... Tag, you're in! <laughs> oh. 